I remember the Miko Worldwide nigga who did our documentary, our vlog. They be at hell for him right now on YouTube. And that little shit came out about bro fucking on that little boy. Kids doing that sick ass shit. That nigga fuck with so basically what we did, we had bro down here yesterday. We took his chain. Took his chain. Uh, took the nigga Flick. Uh, we took his YouTube, YouTube play. <laughs> All that shit. But like it's the principle though. It ain't even about him being gay. We ain't got shit against gay motherfuckers. It's just At like all. bro touching on kids and shit. He fucked that the little boy. Sick. And yeah. you know the nigga was saying team. Yeah, he knew it like he telling her like, bro, like why you did? Nigga ain't have no good excuse on why he did that. We took all of that shit though. We got the video footage, y'all niggas want that shit. Come with that bag, Drop on that me. Bag. Oh, what's, 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 J, yeah. China Mac, uh, uh, AJ Yang. Yeah, we got the all of that shit, y'all. No jump, but send that shit, send that bag, y'all want that footage, man. Oh, oh shit. God. Memphis Goins got that Miko worldwide, man, from them allegations he had on him, man. Yeah, they lured you right into the city, man. Yeah, let you know, oh, it's all good. But see, you got to realize, man, it's a big network in this world, man, that don't like what you did, bro. Set, a, set along your sexual preference. It ain't even got nothing to do with it, man. It's about you messing with an underage person, bro. You messing with a minor, bro. And then the, the situation that went on or the paperwork that's out there, bro, you shouldn't feel safe going nowhere shooting these hood vlogs because, man, you know in the hood they play for keeps, bro. And it won't take nothing but a split second for you to lose your life just like you lost all your merchandise. So you better wake up, man, watch where you're going. You might need to step into the podcast line because these street boys ain't playing with you, man. These goons ain't finna play with you. And it ain't just Memphis, bro. You touch down anywhere, uh, it's going to be a problem when it comes to these streets. Just like you see when you went over there with them YSL young dudes. Them dudes pretty much use you so they can get some exposure. But, man, those folks want, ain't nobody uh, feeling you like that no more. You know what I'm saying? And even the people that is, they can't show it, bro. Because guess what? The masses are against you, man. That's just how this works. So you need to fall back, man, before you lose your life, man. And wise enough, man, think about what you're doing instead of trying to prove to these people you still can go to this hood, that hood, bro. You know what I'm saying? It's nothing to prove, dog. And the allegations that's already out there on you, man. People feel how they feel about you. So, man, the best thing you can do is get out the way, man, try to work this game a different way. But you physically being out here dealing with these folks and all that, man, man, you better wake up, bro. You don't have anything to prove. You ain't got no street dudes backing you. You ain't got nobody in your corner. So, bro, you a one-man army. And you're going to get crushed if you keep on playing out here with these people's intelligence. You keep on trying to go to these people's hood because you, you got to realize you making these people's hood look bad who accept you to come to their hood. So, for one, you shouldn't be trusting what you're doing anyway. We got to keep our head Man, focus, man. Keep our eyes open. And to them brothers in Memphis, man, the young brothers who did the lick, man, we got to wise up for a simple fact, man. I understand y'all frustration. I understand y'all anger towards the guy. And, and, and in a way, I see what y'all did. You know what I'm saying? I understand what y'all did. In a way. And that's only if you're looking at it from a street perspective. That's, that's the way that I understand it. But at the end of the day, man, these brothers got to realize, man, y'all gave the folks the whole uh, case. Y'all just told on y'all self. So if they ride down on y'all and this dude cooperate, they get any type of evidence, bro, y'all gone, man. So we all got to think our life in this situation, man, because even if y'all would have took this guy's life, it's documented that he coming to this place. It's documented that he coming to see y'all. Don't think that dude ain't dot his eye across the T, because guess what? He in fear for his life. He just trying to go out there and kind of, just like when you put your foot in the pool and test how cold the water is, that's all he doing right now. But that dude need to wake up, man, because he can lose his life out here playing like that, man. And, I, and my young guys, this, he need licks and doing different stuff like that, man. Keep y'all business off the internet, man.